सो देर आर लॉट ऑफ मेमरीज यू नो वेन वी वर स्कूल गोइंग किड्स तो एक बार हमारे स्कूल में टीचर होते थे साइंस के मिसेज सुमन मैनी और ऐसा ही हुआ कि आप जो नो हमारा जब क्लास में जब इंस्पेक्शन चल रहा था और सुमन मैनी मैम ने पूछा हमको कि तुमने होमवर्क किया है तो विक्रम ने क्या किया कि विक्रम ने मेरी यू नो कॉपी थी जो होमवर्क की वो निकाल ली और जब मैम उनके पास पहुंची उन्होंने अपनी बुकलेट दिखाई यू नो ऑफकोर्स उनको लगा होमवर्क कंप्लीट है पर जब मेरे पास आके मैम ने मुझे पूछा कि यार विशाल तुम्हारा होमवर्क दिखाओ तो मैंने देखा मेरी बुकलेट थी नहीं मेरे बैग में तो मैंने मैम को बोला मैम मैंने तो होमवर्क किया था तो बाय द टाइम आई लुक डेट विक्रम एंड विक्रम आर स्माइलिंग एंड मैम गेव मी अ स्लैप एंड द मैम रियलाइज की यू नो इसने विक्रम में कोई गड़बड़ करी है कि विशाल की कॉपी निकाल के मुझे दिखा दी और जो थप्पड़ रियलिटी में विक्रम को पढ़ना चाहिए था वो मुझे पड़ गया सो दैट्स वन ऑफ द मेमोरीज विच आई फ्रॉम द चाइल्डहुड माय हाउस एंड विक्रम विशाल हाउस फॉर हार्डली जस्ट 500 मीटर्स अवे एंड देयर वाज सो मेनी इंसिडेंसेस व्हेन दे गेट बैशिंग फ्रॉम देयर पेरेंट्स एंड दे कम टू आवर प्लेस एंड एंड हाइड देयरसेल्फ देयर एंड देयर पेरेंट्स कीप ऑन सर्चिंग वेयर इज विक्रम वेयर इज विशाल एंड दे they found them at my particular place do we never call him or addressed him as uh, vikram we used to call him as love jani and love jani ki jitne bhi exploits i used to be the partner in crime and the secrets were never disclosed at any point so i uh, came to visit uh, uh, vikram in uh, dav college uh, chandigarh so we went out and uh, we said we want to have a good lavish food he was so fearless we have done a, a gate crash marriage gate crash we went inside we just wore one uh, uh, blazer and uh, just went inside had good food and came out so th- so those kind of uh, incidents are really uh, uh, there in the memories and always comes in the thought and it shows he, he was fearless okay dekhi jayegi jo bhi hoga kind of thing <laughs> attitude <laughs> he was so full of josh he was uh, always so active whenever uh, whenever we used to meet him or we used to go out with him you know there are fond memories of our going together to kasoli and the program was made just off the hat it was just uh, we all were sitting together having cup of tea we said let's go to kasoli we picked up our bikes and went there spend some time and came back so it was always you know with him one was uh, very lively lively feeling used to get when we were with him there was a very famous serial title parveer chakra so hmm. it was not even that we were in the same school and pvc used to be uh, telecasted uh, every sunday in the morning at 9 o'clock aur hamare ghar mein tv nahi hota tha hum kisi padosi ke ghar pe ja ke tv dekhte the serial dekhte the that was the time when you know the passion of joining the uniform The, you know donning the green color started it was uh, you know 12th of march 1996 when vikram went for sssb and <coughs> i went on 14th of march 1996 or incidentally hum dono ka center same tha which was alabad and vikram was a part of 19 alabad and i was a part of 18 alabad and as uh, you know colonel uday mentioned ki you know vikram ko college mein jani bhi bolte the to kya hota tha ki ssb used to be for 4 days so vikram ka kyunki interview was reporting was 12th march mine was 14 so there was a lag of 2 days and it was on 16th of march you know when when vikram's final law, interview with the president had to happen or ssb me hota hai typically that you all assemble all the candidates who have come for the interview and your results gets announced aur mera un dino mein ground test chal raha tha and uh, i was more concerned about vikram's result rather than focusing on my own ground test and it was a break incidentally it was a break in between and it was around 10:30 in the morning aur uh, vikram ke kafi classmates the jo ssb dene ikatte ek hi batch mein the incidentally jab wo ssb dene ke liye aaye the aur uh, तो दूर से मेरा मेरा टी ब्रेक था तो मैंने दूर से तो पूछा है गाइस व्हाट इज द रिजल्ट एंड समबडी फ्रॉम द ग्रुप शाउटेड हे जानी इज थ्रू जानी इज थ्रू सो दैट वाज द फर्स्ट टाइम यू नो वी वेरी हैप्पी बिकॉज़ मी एंड विक्रम वेंट टुगेदर एंड वी ऑलवेज वांटेड दैट हम दोनों एक साथ एसएसबी देने गए तो एटलीस्ट वन ऑफ अस शुड मेक थ्रू वी शुड गेट थ्रू एंड दैट वाज द टाइम व्हेन वी रियलाइज दैट ओ यू नो विक्रम हैज फाइनली मेड इट इट वाज सेलिब्रेशन इन हॉस्टल एज़ वेल एब्सोल्युटली इट वाज सेलिब्रेशन इट वाज अ कंप्लीट सेलिब्रेशन इन हॉस्टल एंड इन फैक्ट यू नो आई विल एग्री टू गुरी बिकॉज़ व्हेन आई वाज इन एसएसबी गुरी I forgot what happens to my result because I was so enthralled that चलो मेरा हो ना हो कोई ना विक्रम इज़ गोट सेलेक्टेड। I remembered one of the incidences uh, you know which is very fond with me uh, uh, is that uh, he went out for a operation and generally that's the insurgency times and he was in the thick of a uh, you know forest and uh, he was uh, I think the uh, he was the platoon commander he was leading with four or five people and a bullet came and the bullet sneaked through his ear and it hit the guy who was behind him and that guy lost his life. 
and Vikram was very upset and he made it a point that by next morning they had killed two terrorists but what he explained to me ki, when you typically join the forces you know you don't have a family back home the forces itself becomes your family right and, and that's so well entrenched in my mind because that's what the action what we saw in the Kargil war when he was leading the attack in 5140 and 4875 so the realization I have is that when you get into the infantry a bullet is made by your name and whether you get that bullet or you don't get that bullet is a destiny one day I, when I came back to the office I said where's Vishal uh, so Vishal was not on his seat I asked his colleagues that uh, where's Vishal they said aapko nahi pata uske brother ko goli lag gayi hai I was not aware till that time so uh, when I heard this my first reaction was is he fine uh, so uh, the, 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 I didn't get the correct answer there and then itself so I uh, the, then I said where he is he said uh, he's gone to Rohini to his sister's place uh, so I tried to call uh, call up Didi and then when I from there I came to know that he is no more and by the time uh, the TV was scrolling uh, all the Barkha's interviews, Yadil Mange Moore and all that kind of uh, captions and all that. So that was really a heartbreaking moment. I really, I, I, I think I, uh, I couldn't control myself. The, and I, I, it was unbelievable that this can happen, but uh, it was the reality. And uh, it was really heartbreaking reality. Incidentally, 8th of July, we lost him on 7th of July, 8th of July afternoon. And uh, I was sitting on my chair and unfortunately I picked up the call. A ring came and I picked up the call and he says, uh, can we talk to Vishal Batra? And I said, yes, Vishal here. And I said, Hindi. Mein, uh, aapke liye buri khabar hai. The moment that guy said, aapke liye buri khabar hai, I could sense that we've lost Vikram. Because we were seeing so many coffins coming around every now and then. And I said, kya hua? And he said, aapke bhai sahab ko goli lag hai. And the first belief that I had in my mind was that Vikram is not a guy who will go with a single bullet. I said, Wo hai na? So he said, I'm sorry, uh, he's no more. But somehow mujhe laga ki, abhi bhi, you know, I had some belief deep in my heart that news ho sakta hai galat ho. So that was the unfortunate day of 8th of July, uh, you know, when, when I got the news of his martyrdom.